across here in Denbyshire now. Yeah, the wind is blowing us. There it is. Side wind. Slow down, it'll blow us off the road. I thought this window wasn't coming till uh, tomorrow night. Mountains. That's a strong wind blowing. Blowing completely sideways on us. sheltered by there, but it should be sheltered before. Out the wind here. Back in it now in a minute. Right on the top now, it is very, very windy. Is my sponge on my mic working or not? I use on my mic, I glue a bit of sponge off a roller on my microphone over the top of the mic. That's my way of uh, deadening the wind. Nice up here, look at that. Should stop, but it's uh It's beautiful. Coming up these behind. Not far from Bala now, I'd say about eight mile perhaps. Dropping all the way down now, get out of this wind. Wind is very bad. Wind and some of these gusts actually steering the bike. Hopefully, now just getting down a bit lower, now should get a bit better. Look at that for a nice December uh, ride out on the bike, isn't it? about the 7th of December, I'm not 100% sure. Right, it's about 8 and the sun is out. Even with a shadow on the tarmac now. Just a pity this wind wasn't just a bit, little bit lower. <laughs> Very, very windy up here. There's a few things I don't like on the bike. That's one is wind. It's high wind, it blows all over the place, no matter what bike you're on. And I don't like on the ice. Well, fog as well. Fog, ice and high winds. Mind everything else, don't mind the rain, don't mind the sun.
you ever want, if you want to know the road I've come on now, you come from Welshpool to Lambuslin to Bala and just keep straight on the road without turning off. This is the road you come along. It's absolutely stunning ride in the summer. It's good today, but in the summer it is uh, in the autumn. There's no colour about now, all the leaves are all gone off the trees. If you come up here in the spring or autumn and summer, probably autumn is probably the best time of year to come up here. If you want uh, the colours, but the summer is pretty damn good up here. You get a fair time up here, it's steep up here. Need to be warm by the time we get to the top. Second round here. So one thing for sure on a motorbike in the winter, you don't want to keep your speeds high. Cruise around the 60 mile an hour is pretty good, I'd say. Nice bridge over here. Down on the, up on your right, Bala straight in there. Can we see the lake yet? No, bit too far away. We're concentrating then. A lot of shit in the road. Here we are trying the seat out on the Tenere today. The comfort seat. Pretty good for comfort. Not sure if I want one or not. The only downside of it is uh, if you're off-roading, the standard seat's just slightly a bit lower for off-roading. If you're going into some uh, tricky stuff, that's the only downside I can see on it. Look at this, it looks lovely here. Every time around here. The only downside I can I can think about is with this seat. It is more comfortable, I think. It's a bit more springy. You can feel the, the springiness in the seat. It's a brand new seat, hasn't broken in yet, so it'll get softer. But I'm not sure if uh, that's the only reason why I don't think I'll buy one is because of the off-road inside of it. If you if you're one that doesn't go off-roading, I'd buy one. But if you do a lot of off-roading, I suppose if you're going out days that you know you're going to off off do a lot of off-roading, you ch just change the seat. It'll take five minutes to change. It's an option, I suppose. That's my thoughts on the comfort seat. more comfortable than the standard one. Like I say, this is a brand new seat so it hasn't bedded in yet. And you know yourself with seats, it'll bed in over a bit of mileage on them, they'll bed in.
pumping. Bikers there. That's what it said on the sign. This time of year, I'd rather have a B and B in it. But who's on the bike? Tell me what your thoughts are. I don't think I'd like to uh, camp out this time here in December in the UK on a motorbike. You've got to get warm, dry your kit out a bit. Even the best kit you ride needs drying a little bit sometimes. And about that, I'm going to put my heated gloves on. Just feel my uh, hands are a bit chilly then. Good job here and getting side winds now. up this road it's a better I think it's a better road than this one for scenery up that road to Lake Fernway but we've all got our uh, different preferences go up to Bolka Grice we might go up to Bolka Grice after What time is it? 12 o'clock. In two minds which way to go now. Ah, Bala! Choppy today. No point in uh, showing you around Ballot. 